something else It must be an angel What's that you say? Keeping it real Keeping it you What's that you say? Yay, here we are And um, how lucky are we? The wind blew in a who until our fashionably who Marlo shows up a little bit late. We have Miss Cindy Hello. Hello. Thank you yeah. so much. Yeah. I love it. Thanks. So it is Wednesday, March 25th, and it's already the last Wednesday of March. Where did it go? I feel like February took forever, mm -hmm. and March just went like Phew. flip, right? Yeah. But where's the warm weather? I'm freezing. It will be here. Don't worry. We had some previews. We see it's coming. Uh, I don't, uh, the weather is one thing I just can't be bothered about. They're always wrong. I always think in my next life, though, I want to be an economist or a weatherman, because no matter what they say, they get paid. That's right. <laughs> Right? Exactly. So it is National Lobster Newberg Day, and I couldn't bring the lobster, but it's also National Pecan Day. So we do have some pecans in the house today for our guests when they share a skeleton from their closet. I love this part of this. I love this skeleton. Oh, do you want to show. share? Do you want a pecan? Oh. Mm, let me think of something good. Okay. <laughs> All right. That sounds good. So, uh, pecan. Go get your pecan on. Mmm. Pecan pie, so good. Today, let's see what else happened on this day. The U.S. Girl Scout, Katie Francis, broke the record for selling cookies for the organization's annual fundraiser, selling 18,107 boxes over a seven-week period one year ago. Oh, Katie. Yeah, I heard that the kids are... I, I heard that the kids in Arizona are setting... Uh, it is on our list. We got it right there. Yes, we have it. We get to the birthdays. Yes. Um, so she is the one that's set, set up next to the pot for people. But they just that's bought brilliant. their pot. They didn't get, so, unless they taste it while they were there. They must be doing samples. You get cookies on the way out. Yeah, yeah you, you get cookies on the, on the way out. You get your pot out. and you get your munchies. Exactly. Yeah. Let's go. Stop shopping. Katie, Katie Francis. You sound like a nun. And Gwyneth Paltrow and Chris Martin announced their intention to divorce after 11 years of marriage. The announcement on Paltrow's website was titled Conscious Uncoupling. That was also one year ago today. Oh, Gwyneth. God, Conscious Uncoupling, instead of calling it divorce. I guess, I guess it didn't hashtag very well because I never heard of that, and that's a year ago. But maybe it will now, yes. Oh, uh, what else happened? Mike Tyson was released from jail on this date <laughs> from after serving three years in prison. Go, Mike. I love Mike Tyson. I can't help it. Fire in an illegal New York City social club on this day. Killed 87 oh, people in 1990. Man. Oh, my God. You remember that? That was this day. Can you believe that was 1990? Yeah, that was 24 years ago. 25 years ago. We were getting old. I don't know about that. We're just, <laughs> we're just living. I know. And we've been around for years. It just doesn't seem like 1990 is that long ago. My daughter was born in 90, so that's how I was. That's, that's an easy year for me to figure it out. Robin Givens. Uh, God, they're in the Mike Tyson, Robin Givens. Demands full access to Mike Tyson's money on this day. Oh, Robin Gibbons, the gold digger. Are you on already? Yes, we are. We're on. It's after four. Okay, come when you're ready. Our who just showed up. Marlo. Marlo's in the house. Uh, what's this one? Oh, my God. Fazal ibn Abd al-Aziz, the king of Saudi Arabia, was shot on this day by his nephew. God, how can you do that? It's just terrible. What a world. I know. See, guns are bad everywhere, not only here. Barbara Streisand records the album Butterfly on this day. I love her. America's LP, America, goes to number one on this day. Good for them. The Boston Patriots became the New England Patriots on this day. Traitors. 
Exactly. I mean, come on, they're from New England. We all know what they're they're like the Mayflower people, right? Mm-hmm. But Tom Jones, she's a lady, goes Ooh. bold. Yeah, I love that song. I wonder how many pairs of underwear he got that day. <laughs> they're on, yeah, people used to throw their underwear in him. Exactly. Tom Jones. The Concorde made its first supersonic flight on this day. I always wanted to go on the Concorde, but Ooh. it's not on anymore. They stopped that. That didn't last very long. But today, John and Yoko staged their first bed-in for peace in Amsterdam on this oh. day. Yeah. Oh, John and Yoko. They were oh, something else, were nice. right? Well, I don't know if they were nice, but <laughs> <laughs> they were definitely on top of the world, right? The Turtles, Happy Together, goes to number one on this day. <laughs> yeah. Who and Cream make U.S. debut at Murray the K's Easter show? The Who and Cream. Wow. The Beatles posed with who? multi Did somebody say who? Yeah, there he is. Here's our who. Hey, Marlo. Hey, who are you? How are you? Welcome. Uh -huh. Welcome to Jackie. Yeah, of course. Marlo's always so fashionably everything. So, Cindy was filling in. So you got oh, here. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So we're just going over our daily bullshit. I love all this. What else happened on this day? The Beatles posed with mutilated dolls and butchered meat for the cover of the Yesterday and Today album. It is later pulled. Ha ha. Take okay, that, Lady first. Gaga. She yeah. probably pulled it. She was like, I want to wear a meat dress first. Martin Luther King Jr. led 25,000 to state capitol in Montgomery, Alabama. What did that do? We're still performances. Did you ever see Gypsy? I didn't. I, 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 I had a feeling you were, yeah, they yeah movie. that's fine. I only saw the movie. Yeah. <laughs> the movie's so good, right? I, do you know how many people don't know what Gypsy is right now? I do you time. know what Gypsy is? Half and half. Oh, she doesn't. See, that's a no. How many people yeah. know what Gypsy is? No, make noise. Nobody can see yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. 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 How many people, how many people yeah. don't know what Gypsy is? Make a noise. You don't, yeah, right? No. Hey. They don't know. You have to see oh, Gypsy. I will check it out. Natalie That's Wood. my homework for tonight. Natalie I'll watch Wood Gypsy. Is? I've heard the name. She's heard the name of Natalie Wood. Oh, oh my gosh. Kids. Oh, isn't that oh, mixed? It just blows my mind. No, it's not about so old. It's just in this world of YouTube. You should know who Natalie Wood is. Did you ever see um, The Miracle on 34th Street? Oh, no. Yes. Well, forget it. I'm stopping now. What about <laughs> huh? Did you ever hear of West Side Story? Yes. Yeah, oh, what about Love with a Proper Stranger? They would not have heard of that. But West Side Story, Maria, she was Maria. Okay? But she was also Gypsy, which I don't think is just the best. Elvis Presley performs live on the USS Arizona on this day. Sputnik 10 carries a dog into Earth orbit and later recovered. That poor dog. I know, what did he think? God, <laughs> they don't care. Sugar Ray Robinson is first boxing champ to win five times on this day. RCA manufactures the first color TV set, a 12-inch screen for $1,000 in 1954 on March 26th. We need about 50 of them on that one, all right? Exactly. I know. I wonder how big that screen was. Jimmy Durante and Gary Moore premiere on the radio on this day. My nanny used to sing with Jimmy Durante. Yeah, she was in vaudeville. Jimmy Durante was one of her um, people she sang with. That's what I've heard, anyway. Rumor has it. Yeah. <laughs> Billboard magazine introduces hillbilly country music to the charts on this. Revealed that Quaker Oats pays Babe Ruth. $25,000 per year for his ads for the company in 1937. That's a lot That's of money. That's a lot man. of money. Yeah, mm. exactly. Because it was like a nickel to go to the movies or something like that. I have to <coughs> channel my nana to ask her. Scottsboro boys accused of raping a white woman were arrested in Alabama. Oh, I just don't understand. Some things just never change. 
Uh, what else happened? Women are allowed to attend a boxing match, finally, by law, on this day in, wow, in 19, 1916. Yeah. Can you believe that? We weren't even allowed. I hate boxing now, but I like Mike Tyson. Home of Vaudeville Palace Theater opens in New York, starting starring Ed Wynn. I wonder if my nanny knew him. First demonstration of pancake making in a department store in New York City was on this day. Can you imagine that? I wonder what store it was in 1882 on March 25th. It was the first time. That's where Costco comes from, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. The first horse race in America took place on this day in 1668. And the first Easter, according to the calendar maker Dionysus Exiguus, was on this day in the year 31. So and, uh, then it says, check this one out, the origin of the Dionysian incarnation of the world happened on this day in the year one. So this is actually January 1st. I don't know why it's March 25th, <laughs> but this is really the first day that the calendar ever started. Because it's the day if it's the first Easter. They, they, it was day one, and then 31 years later, when he was 32, he got up, right? Happy New Year! <laughs> 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 Well, no, we've had that before, oh, but today so specifically, if you can. Jeff Healy's birthday is today, Ooh. the blind pop guitarist. I actually know who he is, because yeah. I used to work at the Ritz, and he used to play there a lot. Angel Eyes? Yes, yes. 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 I, he used to yeah. play the, the guitar yeah. on his lap. Yeah, yeah. Jeff Healy, yeah. yeah, he was amazing. Sarah Jessica Parker's birthday is today. Happy Ooh. birthday, Happy Carrie. birthday. Yeah. Haywood Nelson, born in New York City. Dwayne from What's Happening. Uh, Dwayne, it's his birthday. Yeah, right. Dwayne. Dwayne. Oh my God. Dwayne's <laughs> birthday today. Yeah. Nick Lowe. We all know Nick Lowe. Who yeah. To be kind. It's his birthday today. Rockwell. Elton John. It's his Sir Elton John's oh, birthday oh, today. Yeah. I wonder. I wonder if he's talking to Dolce and Gabbana today. If they're coming to his birthday party. Now well, let's see. Ooh. Here, who invented all the Sesame Street puppets birthdays today. Aretha Franklin. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's her birthday oh, today. Oh. We just heard that. Paul Michael Glazer. We all know Starsky. Oh, one of the oh. men who's paved the way for AIDS. Well, happy birthday. Anita Bryant. How funny. Her birthday's right after his birthday. <laughs> oh, man. I know. A very merry on birthday, Anita Bryant. Oh. <laughs> Go drink your juice with all the pits. Ooh. Gloria Stein. Well, she was not nice, I know Nina she Ryan. Was. I mean, I still think she's all right. You know, who cares? Miss America, right? <laughs> exactly. Probably. Johnny Burnett, born in Memphis. Trains kept a rolling. He also wrote the song You're 16. See, you never know the songwriters' names. Exactly. Ringo made that. wasn't for this guy. His birthday is today. And angels, people who passed away on this day, March 25th, Nancy Walker, who doesn't remember Ida Morgenstern on Rhoda, her mother. Oh, yes, she Rhoda. She's a picker up. Yes, exactly. <laughs> that was her, Bounty. Yeah. yeah. That's her, yeah. I think she also had a role in the rear window. She probably did. That would not surprise me at all. David Moore, he was a U.S. featherweight boxer, and he died at 29 years old. I wonder if the boxing had anything to do with that. And Viola Greg Luuzo, who was a U.S. civil rights activist, was murdered on this day. So she died for us. And that's about enough of that. Would you like to push a button? <laughs> there we go. Oh, I'm right into the <laughs> yeah, we'll be right back. Yeah, really. Keeping it real. Keeping it real.